Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video and today we're going to be covering the fourth sighting of the Mimi Tamo event. Uh, we'll be going over the uh, riddles, the items that you need to get, uh, if you need to kill any enemies, what enemies you have to kill, uh, the final boss, uh, where he spawns, his location, his time of spawning, and we'll be going over the small loot at the end. Uh, so, without further ado, let's get into it. So, the first Hilly Churlies are in the western part of the northernmost area of Liwei, so the west part of Xingxi village. And if you go from the same waypoint I did and climb up the mountain, it's the first hilly churl here by the bamboo. When doing this hilly churl's commission, uh, these these a uh, quick tip for both of these hilly churls, it's uh, they're both a bit confusing if you're not reading everything properly. But he says gushi seli boya or boya, however you want to say it. And uh, this is my first time doing it on uh, like on the recording is. And so I go down find gusha and it says vegetables, grasses, fruits, and dislike things. And so, you know, not, this is a very vague one in my opinion, you know, obviously vagueness is, is, is it makes it more difficult, but um, uh, I just went with the vegetables because I'm, I'm sitting here in a bit of confusion, um, but, you know, I just go with vegetables and I make my decision and I go through the list of vegetables and I'm like, okay, which one could it be? So after deciding which one I have the most of, I just went with carrots. I, I gave the guy a carrot and uh, the commission or the the quest continued so i guess i wasn't wrong um i guess that's the key is to not be wrong um i haven't really th i don't really think or didn't try anything else obviously but I, I as long as you're not wrong you know you, you're fine so the next commission is in monstad it's kind of in just above the word wolvendom on the map i travel to the domain here I go up to the actual area, and this one was a bit confusing because in the in like the main area of the actual zone, not a lot of hilly shells spawned, so I was just kind of a bit confused by that. But if you just come to the very tip peak here, kind of like the topmost part of the circle, uh, you'll encounter some animo slimes. You destroy them, and you come back. Uh, this one also again another bit of a bit of a riddle. Uh, a bit more, uh, you have to read a bit more words and kind of read what they mean in the journal. But Lata Boya Sada, uh, you go into the manual. And, and this one, in my opinion, was pretty much equally confusing or maybe slightly more confusing, mainly because I wasn't reading things properly. Um, but when you keep on scrolling down, you'll find at one point it says uh, Sada, which is one of the words, and Boya, which is the other word. So... The main things to look at here is the solid. Sada means a solid or hard, and boya means to denote colors. Yeah, if you read, keep on reading the boya thing, it says latter boya is blue. So pretty much what it's saying is that you're looking for a, a blue solid or hard thing, in um, uh, to give as an item. <clears throat> and through a bit more my mental processing power being used, like in the actual recording. I uh, kind of kind of connect the dots. I kind of do it here, and so uh, there's there's a few blue solid items in the game. I'm, I'm not really exactly sure which one. I'm assuming all of them are correct. But you could do the blue flower. You could do Nocta Lucas Jade. You can do the conch. You can do the magical crystal chunk. So I just went with the crystal chunk just because it's the one I have the most of, and it wasn't wrong. Now, I'm not sure if you can actually get things wrong in the uh, actual little um, thing, but whatever. Now we're given a time, which is Unta Mossi Dada. Uh, this time period is uh, just before sunset, or pretty much afternoon. After clicking go, into, go to investigation, you're given his location, which is at the stone gate. The very tip peak of the stone gate on the right side. Travel to the uh, location of the unusual hilly churl wait till the appropriate time which i just waited till kind of like mid noon two o'clock or rather sorry three o'clock i waited till three o'clock accurate enough time and after waiting you climb to the peak of the actual cliff or the hill whatever you want to call it i i checked down just because i'm you know met by chance did they put him in a hole they didn't you climb to the peak here he's right there and like usual the boss fight starts and you do the same process
And there you have it. After a lot of damage being done, you kill the unusual healer chill and you get the cabbages and you get the loot. Overall, uh, easily done. Not, not, not too difficult. Uh, the rewards that you get are, as usual, 60 Prima Gems and 60,000 Mora. Uh, and for this furnishing piece, it is a wall divider. Quite a nice looking wall divider. I'll definitely make a lot of these and use them. Uh, but it's uh, pretty nice. Um, if this video was uh, helpful, consider leaving a like and consider subscribing to the YouTube channel. And I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace out.